All right, good morning, everyone. Uh, today, we're cutting silage. Just done the first paddock. Um, this has been uh, direct drilled as annual winter star. So it's a fairly, I think it's a fairly heavy crop. It'll be interesting to see what my dad thinks. Um, we're picking it up with a silerator, a Gallagher silerator. So it's um, fairly long. I haven't measured it to see what it is, but um, what I'm liking at the moment is how green it is underneath. It's, it's still quite green, so once we get this off tomorrow, um, she should be away. Like, it, you know, it's not been left too long, so um, over that way it's quite heavy because the dry cows were in this paddock and I think they started off by going along that way and then come back along this way, so that was that side was grazed first so it had a little bit longer growing time um, yeah it's definitely it'd be interesting to see because I've never put any annual in a stack before and it's quite early it's only the 7th or 8th of I think the 8th of September today so um, yeah it'd be interesting to see is this annual just going to turn to mush in the stack or is it going to be good feed but um, yeah, it's the first time I've ever taken silage off this early. So it will be interesting to see um, how it goes. Not only how it goes in the stack, but um, whether we end up being a bit tight on grass. It's an unusual season, this one. Um, if we didn't have the annual in the ground, I don't think we'd be cutting silage. So, yeah. We've got two and one and a half more paddocks to go and that's all I'm going to cut and then we've got another one, two, three, four paddocks, four paddocks to go into the stack in a couple weeks time so yeah we'll see how it goes. Alright let's carry on.